CSGO launch petting tips number 25. So guys, starting things off, we have Nerd Rage versus UX. Nerd Rage, well, OK team, UX, OK team, form wise and well, how I rate them wise, Nerd Rage should come away with a win easily here. Making it the first safe match of the day. Second match, King Win versus Navi. Here's the deal, yo, guys. I know I have favoritized King Win before. I hate King Win. I, I, I fucking despise King Win. Still, as a YOLO bet, the bet on King Win is actually looking up before the bet on Navi. Because, I mean, we all know Navi isn't that good and hasn't been that good as of recently. And, well, I don't see King Win losing two matches. And on that note, the bet on King Win is way more fun because it can earn you money. Delicious money. So, YOLO bet of the day is on King Win versus Navi. King Win will win. Yeah. Um, next match, Mouse versus Dignitas. Wow, I actually don't know what I'm going to say about this game. I mean, guys, the thing is here, Mouse is in one heck of a form, but so is Dignitas, and the thing here, guys, don't exclude Dignitas out of anything, and well, my advice to for you today is don't bet on it because I mean, I don't know if bet, but uh, no, just don't, don't, guys. Resist. No, 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 no. Next match, then envious versus flip side. Form wise, team wise, I win. Every way wise, envious should win. I win. Though bear in mind that Flipside is on the verge of being full tier 1. I mean, they are not bad, but... I mean, they are at the Hellraiser's level. I mean, Hellraiser's not really bad, but not really that impressively good either. So, Envious versus Flipside, Envious going to win. Uh, next match, Neophyte versus Hellraiser. So don't fucking don't. Neophyte is one of the teams I hold while well, almost highest. They've impressed me so incredibly recently. And fact of the matter is that Hellraisers, well, they have been good, but guys. They have been good. They are good. They are good. But, I mean, seen to form-wise and team-wise, Neophyte seem to have something going on. And I would not exclude him, exclude them in a match against Hellraiser. So, yes, don't. Let's do it. In the shock versus alien tech, this should, could, and order only end with the in shock win. In shock versus alien tech, in shock is going to win. I mean, it's in the best out of three, alien tech is not going to stand a chance. Next match, then envious versus titan. Here's the deal, yo. Envious not in their best form. Titan. Well, they give and take too much. I mean, yeah, I mean, uh, uh, for instance, Titans' wins have come against Fnatic. I mean, they've beaten every team in form. And if Envious are not on their toes, they can lose this match. So I would... I mean, if you want to uh, to completely YOLO, I'd bet on Titan, but I'd refrain from betting on this match. Moving on, the next match, Fnatic versus Nip. I'm sorry, Nip, I love you. I'm sorry, I love you. I love you, Nip, but this match should, could, and only 
should an order only end with a Fnatic win? I mean, Nip, however great they are, because they are great, they're splendiferous. Yeah, exactly, because they're Nip. Fnatic has been that one point higher in the game so far this season. I'm not saying that it can't change in, uh, at all, but Fnatic, I mean, Fnatic is Fnatic, am Fnatic I right? Is Fnatic is Fnatic. Yeah, no, yes, Fnatic yeah, is... Kidding, yeah, is yeah, yeah, I mean, if Fnatic is Fnatic, that gives you the result of that. Nip is not really Nip yet, so yeah. Fnatic versus Nip, Fnatic should win. Next match, Titan versus Virtus Pro. The thing over here is Virtus Pro is in form. Titan, well, as I've said before, they give and take. And seen to Virtus Pro's form, I'd go with the better than Virtus Pro. Because Titan is going to have a buttload of matches today. And actually, my guess is that they're more focused on beating Envious, Navi, and Team Solomid than beating Virtus Pro, who are in excellent form. So, Titan versus VP, VP is going to win. Next match, G Play versus Space Soldiers. Seen to their form, G Play is on the verge of going up to being Tier 1. Space Soldiers. Solid tier 2 team, I mean, they're right there I'm all, along with, well I can't figure out any tier 2 teams now. I mean, they're, they're a solid tier 2 team, and G play Verge have been tier 1, I can't see any other un outcome than G play coming away with a victory. So, next match, G Play versus Space Soldiers, G Play is going to win. Next match, and the match I bet on, Fnatic versus Envious, Fnatic is going to win because, well, Fnatic is Fnatic. They are in the form, they, their only loss recently has come against Titan, and still Envious, great team, I, I don't mind Envious, but the thing is here, their form is... Not that best. I mean, they're a key team, but everything is form-wise. Everything is form-wise, and, well, Fnatic should, couldn't, well, they ought to win, because Fnatic is Fnatic. Yay. Yay. Next match, the Navi versus Titan. Just don't. Both are in iffy form, both can play so much better, both all the come away with wins easily in this match. Just don't bet on it, you won't earn money, you'll only lose money. Next match, Flipside versus Team Solomid. Another safe match of the day, because Team Solomid, all that should, could and only can win this match. Flipside, uh, I mean they're... Eh. It's hard to describe their... They are also in iffy form, and Team Solomid, well... It's like Fnatic with them. Team Solomid is Team Solomid, and they should, couldn't... Only going to come away with a win here. So, flip side versus Team Solomid. Team Solomid is going to win. Next match, Envious versus Navi. Don't. Next match, Team Solomid versus Titan. I mean, it's the same thing here, guys. Team Solomid, looking great, feeling great. Titan, okay team, actually, great team. Give and take form-wise. Though Team Solomid would, should, and could, and only shall come away with a victory here. I mean, it, it, should, it should only end one way with the Team Solomid win. Next match, Noble versus Nexus. I mean, my brain actually just exploded by thinking of this game. Nexus, give and take. Noble, give and take. Noble, I hold Noble in higher regards than I do Nexus. 
and on that point Noble should come away with a victory. I still do have my reservations on betting on tier 2 US teams because they're so even. They're so even guys, but if you have got a bet, I'd go with a bet on Noble. Next match, Liquid vs. Tempo Storm. Oh, for fuck's sake. I mean... Well, my heart says Liquid, and they are in a ridiculous form as of recently. But the thing here, guys, Tempo Storm... Tempo, Tempo Storm... Storm, I can't even speak English. Tempo Storm has really hit their stride, and... Well... Well, I mean... Fuck it. Okay, let me tell you... Let me tell it like this, then. If you want to bet in it, my heart and brain says liquid, but if you want to YOLO bet, I'd go with uh, Tempo Storm. But, I mean, liquid has equally high of a chance of winning as Tempo Storm does, so... I mean... <laughs> Do you want to yolo bet Tempo Storm? Do you want to bet safe? Go with Liquid. And it can end either way. And there you have it. CSGO Lounge betting tips of the day. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you soon. Bye for now.